we're going to be scrolling on the scroll saw. This is part of a logo. And this I'm going to cut and I'm going to kind of shape it to make it more round. So I'll do that as well. So we're just kind of winging it today. So this is just contact paper. I put this down on MDF or whatever material I'm using. is going to be out of this thin one eighth. So all I did was cut out oops, the outline and then I'm going to cut out the shadows.
And I'm doing like a stack cut, like floral piece or something. I would put contact paper in, or if I'm like stack cutting two sets of something, I'll put contact paper in between. But if there's some things that aren't going to be pulled apart, I don't bother. Because I find that those little pieces of contact paper in between are not really right. But yeah, with fonts and things that are super, super accurate and ostrich um, monoline and things like because this logo she wanted it to be a little smoother but not completely perfect so this was my way of doing that because I'm usually really OCD when it comes to things being straight way of doing that some of them soon like if you're gonna let them sit for a few days I'd recommend just doing contact paper like right now wasn't too difficult to pull them apart but like without the contact paper but if it sits for too long I wasn't very good with puzzles as a child. Um, but I got the heart that I will do a little bit I will be back tomorrow to do a glue up. And you guys can always send me a message on my Instagram or um, Facebook. But I think that's all for now. And I will see you guys hopefully tomorrow. So I hope you guys have a good night. And I'll talk to you later.